Establishing this humanized mouse model can aid in preclinical HIV research studies. For example, both different viral strains and novel HIV interventions can be evaluated. These protocols can be used to evaluate stem cell donor CCF5 variant status and to efficiently infect humanized mice with HIV and to quantify mouse plasma viral loads. The RNA quantification protocol can be easily adapted to quantify any viral RNA sequence of choice that is detectable within plasma samples. For genetic screening of cord blood samples for CCR5 Delta 32 variants, incubate 1.25 microliters of non-pelleted flow-through with 11.25 microliters of PCR mix containing 200 micromolar DNTP mix, 0.01 unit per microliter of high-fidelity DNA polymerase, and forward and reverse primers as detailed in the table. Adjust the volume with nuclease-free water to approximately 12.5 microliters for each PCR reaction and amplify the genomic fragments with the PCR cycling program, as indicated in the table. At the end of the reaction, separate the PCR products on a 2% agarose gel. PCR products from the wild-type alleles and the Delta-32 alleles yield PCR fragments of 196 base pairs and 164 base pairs, respectively making the bands easily distinguishable by gel electrophoresis. For intravaginal HIV exposure, place a heating lamp focused on the center of the workspace where the mouse will be located.